Yo, what's going on guys? Galaxy's here. Back. Actually, literally back for a Pokemon Shield Nuzlocke. Now, I went inactive for quite a long time. About three months. Back on my channel back in summer, I uploaded... This is like a quick rundown before we get started. Because I am excited to jump into this. But, I uploaded Borderlands and Nuzlocke, and I really wasn't having fun because I was doing those on my PC, and I was like, I mainly play on my Switch, so why am I uploading stuff I'm not going to enjoy, and I'm sacrificing my personal freedom of playing with my friends and stuff to play on PC to upload that, that I'm not really enjoying, and I didn't have a capture card, I didn't have a webcam, but now I got a capture card, I got a webcam, and I've been working on layouts and my layout making skills, and I think this layout is pretty fire. For our first LP layout, not gonna lie, I really enjoy it. I made this myself. Photoshop skills in the making. Um, but I also stream on Twitch now, and we have socials, Twitter and Instagram. Those will be in the description, and also my Twitch will be in the description. I stream every. I'm starting to stream. My first stream will be this weekend, but I stream every Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Um, and I'll usually tweet out, I still gotta make a time schedule of what time I'm gonna be streaming on those days, but I love interacting with you guys, we're gonna do raids together, we're gonna shiny hunt, we're gonna do FFAs together, and maybe I even battle some of you guys with my shiny Pokemon, so it's gonna be great, I'm gonna interact with you guys, because I love meeting new people, and playing with new friends, so without further ado, I'm just ready to jump into this, are you guys ready to jump into this? I'm ready to jump into this, let's go, we're English, okay, what is our character? Uh, we'll just choose that. Uh, get name? What is my name? You don't know who I am. I am Galaxies. I can't even spell Galaxies. My lord. Somebody let me know. If you choose a Japanese, does it like change the language of all your Pokemon? Like make them form? I don't know if that works that way. I don't know if it works that way. Registration complete. I am pumped. Let's jump into this, please. We're on YouTube, boys. We're on YouTube, fam. Yo, I always thought... By the way, guys, this is not my first time playing the game. Playing through the game. I have about 150 hours on my sword version. I just got shield, so... This guy's a stud. Uh, I'm just gonna say it right now. This guy's a stud. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. Our beloved Gala region is a wonderful place with thriving nature. Beautiful cities and many Pokemon which we share our lives. As you know, our society is able to thrive. What's he sending out? Oh, that's cute. Thanks to the help from these mysterious creatures that we call Pokemon. Yes, Pokemon are all around us, in the sea, in the sky, and even in our towns. Imagine if they actually did, like, animated cutscenes with voiceovers. That'd be wild. And those of us who choose to raise and train Pokemon to do battle and compete, we call Pokemon Trainers. It seems so hype. Oh, but I'm getting carried away. Please allow me to introduce myself. My name is Rose, and it's it's a pleasure to be here. I said it's even though it's it is. <laughs> English, now turn your gaze to the Gala region's greatest Pokemon trainer, your undefeated champion. It's time for Champion Leon's exhibition match. That was a wild entrance, Leon. Your G. I'm trying to think of a voice to do for Leon. Actually, I have no idea. Wonder what Leon's voice is, huh? Exib I didn't even get to read it! Oh my gosh! I didn't get to read it. Pokemon. 
Pokemon Shield. I get it. I didn't get to read it. I wanted to come up with a voice for him. My goodness. Oh, it's a cute little Wooloo. It's cute. We on our phone? I think we are. I think we are on our phone. Hello, hello. Oh, that's your flash to phone galaxies. Wait, this we're wait we're watching Lee's exhibition match on it. You can't cheer him on with your hands are full. You know the only way to properly cheer Lee would be with his famous Charizard pose. Right. Pop, I didn't expect you to see her here today, dear. Isn't this the big day? Yeah, that's exactly why I'm coming running over to get galaxies. Never... Wait, did I just do his mom's voice for this voice? Okay. Never mind watching me notch now. I got it recording at home anyways. I record all my brother's matches. Come with me, galaxies. He should be here any minute. And Lee always brings big peasants when he visits, so I wouldn't forget that bag if I were you. Now I have to run! See you at mine later! See you at mine later. It's probably some British slang. My English skills are terrible. I'm just gonna, like, throw that out there. Do we have to talk to our mom? Oh, no, we need to get her bag. Dad's old bag. Why is the dad gone in every single Pokemon game? Why? I don't, I don't understand. Looking like a stud. My goodness. We are looking like a stud. So, I don't know how we're doing in a first encounter on each route. Um, might do the exclamation mark encounters and count those. Or if we run into a Pokemon, I'm not exactly sure how we're gonna want to do it. Haha! Uh, have a look at you, Galaxies! That old bag looked like it could pull you over. At least we at least we know that it should hold anything Lee might bring, even if it's as big as a Snorlax. I, I doubt a Snorlax would... I doubt a Snorlax would fit in their hop. I'm just gonna... Break your bubble, man. Um... Just relaxing fitting in there. That's a thick boy. A wooloo? What is that doing here? Why is it doing that? It's like... Trying to kill itself. Hey, you silly wooloo. I see what you're up to. Don't go using tackle on the fencing. Now you listen. No going past the fence. No. Everyone knows there are scary Pokemon living in the slumbering wield. Meh. Dude, that Wooloo just dissed him. You gonna do that? You gonna let the Wooloo do that to you, Hop? You gonna let the Wooloo do that to you? Now that that's taken care of, how about it, Galaxies? Let's race. I bet you can. I bet I can make it to the house first. What with you lugging about that big old bag? Well, you got a head start, man. So. Not really fair, but we'll let it slide. We'll let it slide. For now. For now. We'll let it slide. We will let it slide. Yeah. Ooh. Mom, is he here? There you are. There you are at last, Hop. Oh, and you brought galaxies along. Hello, dear. Yeah, yeah, but where's Lee? Have you got him crammed up in a cupboard? He's still not here yet, for the hundredth time. Honestly, Hop. I can't tell, this is the mom. He's not here yet, for the hundredth time. Honestly, Hop, you might learn some patience. He's probably only just arrived at the station in Wedgehurst. <clears throat> and that's where I'm going. You know Lee's hopeless with directions. I'll make sure he doesn't get lost on his on the way. 
Oh, will you? Yes, that's probably for the best. You forgot to come with, Galaxies. You never met my big bro, right? You can't miss on your chance to meet the undefeated champion. Wait for you on the route. I can't English. I'm just gonna be honest. I, my, my reading skills are definitely not up to par. Definitely why my major is nothing to do with English. Thank you very much. Let's get a move on! I remember, Galaxies. My Pokemon come out of nowhere if you walk through the patches of grass. But I got my Wooloo with me, so I'm ready for ba battles against wild Pokemon, of course. But not you, Galaxies. So we'll still clear of the glass as we go. There's not even any grass really on the main route. So... No, he's crowd-pleasing. He's crowd. He is crowd-pleasing. Oh my gosh, what a legend. What a legend. I didn't come up with a voice for him, not gonna lie. What voice do you want to give Leon? Like a cocky voice? I don't know. What voice should we give him? Hello, hello, Wedgehurst. Your champion, Leon, is back. I promise I'll be doing my best to deliver the greatest battles for you to watch. Sorry, unbeatable champion! Leon, you're the, the greatest! Well, thank you for that. I hope you all carry on training up to your Pokemon and never be shy from battle. Then come challenge me for the title champion. We're on it! We've been working our battle skills, just like you've taught us to, Lee! Oh, but Charizard of yours is too strong for likes of us to take on. Too true. The Charizard is blazingly strong. But other Pokemon can be strong as well. That's why I want the strongest of our challengers to fill the gym challenge and come battle me. I wish is for Gallus trainers to work together to become the strongest in all the world. Grrr. Lee! Hop. So, my number one fan in all the world has come out of his way to pick me up. Look at you, Hop. I reckon you've grown exactly an inch and a quarter since the last time I saw you. Bingo! That's the sort of sharp eye that let's keeps undefeated so long. Heh <laughs> heh. These bright eyes over here? I've got it. You must be Galaxies, am I right? I've heard loads about you from my little brother. I'm the Galar's region's greatest ever Pokemon champion. And a massive Charizard fan, too. You're an OG. People call me the unbeatable Leon. Come on, Lee. And you, Galaxies. I bet, bet I can beat both of you back home. That hop. Always wanting to be the best, isn't he? The proper rival was of own. I bet he'd push himself to become something truly, truly special. Well, everyone. I bid you farewell for today. But don't you fret. I'll always be around to make sure everyone is Galar can have a champion time. Haha. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. Why do I always gotta be left behind? Why? Why is that? Why do I always gotta be left behind, huh? Oh, I just teleport back here? Never mind. Come on, Lee. You promised us a present, so out with it. You brought galaxies and me, Pokemon... You did, didn't you? I know you must have. Right then. The gift from the greatest champion. It's showtime, everyone. Oh, <gasps> you did see the cute little ones. Where's my phone? I was gonna ran randomly generate a number. I don't know where my phone is. I don't know where my phone is, man. I chose Score Bunny on my shield. So, I might choose Swabble.
Cutscene is awesome. All right, everyone, line up. Yeah, I'm gonna choose Swabble. My character looks way too excited. Kind of creepy, not gonna lie. Just gonna throw it out there. Just gonna throw it out there. Just kind of creepy. Go on, you pick first. I already got my Wulu after all. I want Swabble. Swabble, Swabble. Look at him, he's so cute. That's the water type Swabble. It adapts to anything, as surely as water flows. You want the water type Swabble? Yes. What do we nickname this thing? I'm gonna name him Zero. Is this a female? No. From Borderlands. He's he almost like a sniper. In his last form. Oh, that's cute. Look at him! Look at Zero. So it'll be Sabo for you. Nice one! And I'll go with Score Bunny. You're mine! I'm aiming to be the next champion, so be ready. And I'll be doing some serious training. I'm pretty sure I'm changing Hop's voice like every second, but I don't care. I bet you will be Hop. Uh, wait, what? That's why I brought along these Pokemon for you in Galaxies. The two of you can battle and train and grow stronger together. To try and reach me. Poor Grookey. And you will come with me. Charizard will show you the ropes. He's strict, but real strong and kind too. Alright, enough for all this trainer nonsense for one night. Dinner's... Dinner's ready, children. Bring along your Pokemon. And I'm also doing the voice again. I can't commentate. I can't. Dinner's ready, children. Bring along your Pokemon, and let's all eat. Can't commentate. I cannot commentate for the life of me. I can't, okay? Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Okay. Jeez. <laughs> Bullies. Wow, those are some... Is it like a burger on a shish kebab? What is happening? <laughs> the next day. You spent the whole night with that new partner of yours, right, Hop? You two, you two getting on all right? Understanding one another? They even built up a bit of love. Of course I have, Lee. Galaxy's made fast friends with his Sobble, too. Now listen up, new trainers. Believe in yourself and your Pokemon. If you trusted one another and carry on battling side by side long enough, then someday, you might even become worthy rivals for me, the unbeatable champion. What are you looking at him for, Lee? I'm the only one who'll be coming to challenge you. If you think Galaxies might be able to challenge you, then I guess he's my, my first rival. I'm not planning to lose to him and miss out on my chance to beat the unbeatable champion. Just having a Pokemon with you doesn't make you a real trainer, you know. Proper trainers raise up their Pokemon to be first-rate in battle, too. Oh, and you think you're worthy of calling yourself such a proper train already, Hop? Guess I'll be the judge of that. Let's see how you handle yourself in a battle against your friend if he's up for it. What do you say? Willing and ready to take Hop on in the first ever Pokemon battle of your life? Yes, I am. Believe in your partner Pokemon and care for them, too, with all your heart. Do those two things, and I'm certain... Learn to choose the moves that suit your Pokemon. Most importantly, to have a, a champion time battling with them. Looks like everyone on board, Pokemon and trainers alike. Then let's do this. I've watched every match Lee's ever had. I'm ready, I'm, I read every book and magazine he's left behind at home, too. I know exactly what to do in order to win. Do you? Do you really, Hop? Do you really? See what you got, boy. Wow, I just hurt my knee on my desk. Yeah, I'm not reading your text right now. Can we see natures in battle? Jolly. 
got jolly nature. That's a terrible. Terrible. Pound. Wow. Again, make sure you guys come out to my stream. Stream will be in the description. I'll be streaming tomorrow, actually. This will be going up later tonight. I will be streaming tomorrow. And... Probably Saturday and Sunday. So come check me out. We'll be probably doing grinding some raid battles with you guys and stuff. It'll be great. And your Wulu just got... Terminated. Learned Water Gun. Yeah, uh, your starter, send it out. It's gonna die. Water gun. Bop. Easy. Yeah, I already knew the type of advantages. I'm a pro. I've just been reincarnated as a different trainer for all these years. For like 10 years. Been a reincarnated. Hold on. Y'all see this? I always have one of these. Always. Behind uh, my desk. We get a Crystal Geyser sponsor. Just saying, it's about the only thing I drink. Is that. Crystal Geyser. Hit me up. <laughs> Hit me up. You just got wrecked. Well, that was a shock. Guess I already know why Lee thought he should give you a Pokemon, too. You and your Pokemon all fought hard. Made me almost want to let out Charizard and join in all the fun. Yo, you would have absolutely obliterated a Pokemon, so no thank you. Good effort out there, Sobble. Why don't I, g I get all you sorted? Oh my gosh, I cannot. English, help me. I need to go back to kindergarten. And Galaxies, you've got real promise. In fact, I've got a favor to ask you. Be a real rival to Hop, would you? Push him, and make make the both of you stronger. I already want to get stronger and stronger. You've seen it. you seen my battle now, Lee. So come on, you've gotta let me take on the Pokemon gyms. You, join the gym challenge? You think you're ready for a single greatest competition in the Galar region? Not putting the cart before Rapidash there, little brother? That's really what you want to do. You two have a whole lot to learn. A whole lot you need to learn about Pokemon. Especially your friend Galaxies. Before you think about getting gym badges, best thing to think about getting a Pokedex. A trainer's Pokedex helped them learn lots of things and about all the Pokemon out there, including their strengths. But it's more than just a collection of data, you know. It's a trainer's record of love and passion for Pokemon training. Right, right. When we get it, Pokedexes then. We're on it. Looks like it's off to the Pokemon Research Lab for me, you and me, Galaxies. That's the kind of enthusiasm a trainer needs. I'll let the professor know to expect you. I'm going to be the next champion, so completing a simple Pokedex will be nothing. Just another page in the ta tale of my legend. You probably better go tell your mom. Mum. Your mum. That we're heading out, though. I really gotta tell my mom. Galaxies, did you just hear that now? The gate's open and the Hulu that was there. gone. It was talking the fence pretty hard earlier. You don't think it actually broke through there, did you? But it's off limits. Nobody's supposed to go in there. I remember Professor's granddaughters went in there once and she came back in a real state. What? And that was nothing compared to the earfuls she got from the Professor afterward. Galaxies, what do you say? What if you say, I don't know? I don't know. Right. No one wants to get in trouble. At least all of me. But deep down, you want to save that Pokemon too, don't you? Hope you're ready for anything, because we're going in, Galaxies. <laughs> There's no option. Why do they give you the option, then? <laughs> it makes no sense. It's funny. It's actually really funny. That Wooloo, where do you think it got off to? The fog is really coming on thick now. If we don't find that Pokemon soon, this might be trouble. Right. I don't think we have Pokeballs yet. We don't, so the Nuzlocke has not started.
this cute little school bed. This is by far like one of the cutest Pokemon that has ever been put into a Pokemon game. Not gonna lie. Blech. Tackle. Eat it up. Eat it up, eat it up, eat it up. Boop. Squirrel that fainted. Give me that XP. So, playing through this game on Sword. I'm. Okay, I'm sort of expecting this game to be decently challenging, actually. I actually expect it to be decently challenging. From when I played through it, I remember I, I lost a couple Pokemon in, in some of the gym battles, or the gym challenges. So I don't know, I actually don't know how this will play out. I'm not 100% sure, but... I guess we'll have to figure that out. We'll figure that out sooner or later if we're gonna die. <laughs> I hope we don't lose. Who is that? Walking... What time is it? Oh, elementary school just got out. I live like right by an elementary school. There's like a bunch of old women walking down the street and I was kind of confused. <laughs> Did you hear that? Was that the Pokemon crying out you think? Dude, do you not know Wooloo's cry? You own a Wooloo. My, my guy. You own one. You have a Wooloo. What is wrong with you? You don't know Wooloo's cry? You call yourself a Pokemon trainer? Call yourself a Pokemon trainer. Call yourself a loser. You're terrible, bro. To what, what is that gonna do? But anyways, back to the topic. I think this game will be decently challenging. I'm not gonna lie. Especially, like, the fireplace. I'm trying to think of all the hard places that I fought. I don't really remember. Stop talking so I can talk, Hop. Come on, Galaxies. The Wooloo might be in real trouble. So, people get mad for yelling in here because there's some things, but then the Pokemon are weak in here? It's like, what is actually going on? Like, realistically. What is actually going on? This is mad. I can't even see my own hand in front of my face. I don't think... I get now why this place is off limits. Just because of deep fog. Really? Really? Just because of the fog, you can't- the people don't allow you to go in here. Huh? Okay. i make okay. 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 What in the- Grill. Oh my god! What is this Pokemon? What? I don't know what this Pokemon is, man. Move has no effects. The, mirrors, the mysterious Pokemon gazes on you. What? The move had no effect on it. There's another move, man. Uh. Who is this summon fog? Galaxies, I can't see anything. You okay? I don't even answer. <laughs> I've disappeared into the cosmos. To the cosmos, I am galaxies, planet destroyer, planet destroyer. I can't see anything. Whoa, uh. What are you doing, homie? What are you doing, mate? What are you doing? It's like I fell on the ground, and it's like blurry cutscene. Oh no. Yep, never mind. <laughs> I was right. Look at his face. Hop, oh, galaxies. I didn't even know we were here. What? Well, Lee, how did you manage to find your way here? You, your pants with directions. You always get lost. Oh, that's nice to hear from a little brother who had me worried sick. I've been waiting ages for you two, and you two never showed. Of course I came looking for you both. 
Wait, I thought you were going to the, to let there no, not stay there. Okay. Wait, where's the Wulu? We were trying to rescue that Wulu. Meh. <laughs> Little chap's just fine. Though all of you ha had fainted by the time I found you here. You know this place is out of bounds. But it took courage to come in here. All the same. And I can understand well enough why you did it. You did good, Hop. And at least that Wulu's alright. Yeah, Galaxies? I thought we had it when that weird fog started rolling and in that mad Pokemon attack. But at least it wasn't all for nothing. Attacked by some mad Pokemon? What are you talking about, Hop? It seemed load stronger than any Pokemon I've ever seen. And it just had this sort of presence. Our moves didn't even touch it. I mean, really. They seemed to pass right through it. Your moves passed right through it. So, with the fearsome wild Pokemon they say live in the slumbering weald, are they actually illusions or something? Get strong enough. Maybe you two could see be the real. You two. Maybe the two of you could be one to reveal the truth someday. For now, let's simply get out of this place. You'll be alright now that I'm here with you. Even if we did get an earful from Lee, what an experience. This would make a pretty fine first page in the tale of my legend. Right. Cool. Don't forget to tell your mom we're off to Wedgehurst now. She'll go spare if you leave without a word, even if it's even worse than Lee just did. Lee didn't even really diss us. Like, be frank. <laughs> be frank here. Wah! Well now, isn't it Subbo just a sweetheart? Yes. I heard the news from young Leon. I'm glad someone bothered to tell me. Off the Wedgehurst, aren't you? Here we are. A bit of pocket money for your journey. Buy yourself a little something at the Poke Center. Maybe some potions or something. Remember that Sabo will battle to the very end for you. So don't go pushing the poor deer too hard. Sabo! And you, Sabo. Look after my little galaxies. Come and rest any time that you need. After all, east or west, home is best. That's a good saying. That's a good saying. We still don't have Pokeballs. Kind of annoying. Here we go. This is quite the big step, you know. My first step towards becoming the next champion. Guess I'll probably train up Score Bunny a bit, having it battle against Pokemon in the grass. You should get yourself the building with the purple roof. And the red white ball. The great red white ball. Mark out in front. That's the Pokemon Research Lab. So he already went there. We're behind. And they're making us go around because stinking Lulus are in the way. But I think that's where we're going to end the episode here, guys. Um, next episode, get the Pokedex. Probably start getting some encounters. And yeah, I don't know when the next episode will be up. Most likely next week. Um, I upload... Right now, my upload schedule is about two or three times during the weekdays. And we stream on Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So you guys might see the next episode next week. But besides that, like I said, make sure to come check out my stream. It'll be down in the description. Do some raid battles with you guys. Do some FFAs with you guys. And do some shiny hunting. So I will see you guys next episode. And on stream. Don't forget that.